Hello MechWarriors, how is it going and welcome to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. We are playing yet another MechLab modded and there's a, there has been an update. There is a new thing here called the Leopard Upgrade. Still under development, the balance is still ongoing, but we have another layer of complexity that we can dump our hard-earned sea bills and YAML points into. These points are acquired by, I believe, finishing Cantina missions, so we gotta keep going with these. Uh, in order to have enough points to get our upgrades going. So we have something like accommodations, we have uh, something like a penalty reduction for dropping too many taunts on a battle reduced and then you know by another 20% here. Human resource to get the pilots recovered a bit quicker, uh, reducing the pilot salaries and then another upgrade. So you can see these little arrows here, it's just this plus a little bit more. Uh, we can uh, just invest into politics to get our standing in certain factions a bit up. It cost us 5 points and 3 million sea bills. Uh, we got material advancement, repairs are cheaper and faster. Um, we have reduced uh, repair time for armor, that's pretty cool. Uh, repairs are an additional 30% cheaper and 10% faster, love it. Field repairs are faster and cheaper, reduces the mech upkeep. There are stuff like the bullet bazaar. We get more discount on purchasing weapons and equipment and mechs. And we have a better chance to find rare items. Alright, that's pretty cool, I like that. Uh, and then we can also unlock the black market here. This is the thing I don't really know what's going on here. It says Mech Bay 2 reinforced clamps. The stability clamps aren't what they used to be after decades of use uh, and so on and so on. Increases Mech Bay 2 tonnage limit to 55. Do you say that I need to do that in order to actually be able to drop 55 tons and higher? I want to know. I need to know. We're going to check this out. Salvage crew, this is a thing I really want to invest into because that allows us to potentially get better and more salvage from the battlefield. And that's pretty cool. And we also have this travel thing here. Uh, SLP engines increase transit from jump point uh, entry to planetary orbit by 50%. Then we have all jumps are 15% faster but come with a markup of 10% of sea builds. And then even more of that. So what I'm going to go for now, how do I unlock these? Oh, I have to hold down. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, we got one. Now we have two points left. Um, improves the state of assembled mechs by roughly 10%. That's pretty good. Yeah, I want that. I really want that. I am a loot boy, so let's go ahead and loot. Yeah, we're going to play some more Cantina missions, obviously, to get these up and running. Also, I made up my mind. I want the Hellcat. I want to run this thing. So we are going to click that repair button and we're gonna weep and uh and cry in sorrow <laughs> five and a half million sea builds oh no i mean it is a good one it has a lot of quirks as well so i think i should run it uh, cannot do it yet do we start it's 145 days give me a second so what if i click this all right it's already so much man just repairing the side torsos takes all of our money away. Holy crap, man. Holy crap. I guess we're gonna gather some extra money now. So, I believe what I want to do is I want to drop one of my light mechs. Um, but I don't know which one I will get rid of. It's probably you. Yeah, you have that, you have that SRM spread upgrade. Eh, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Well, we have so many light max. Give me a sec. Could we drop anything from here that we don't want? Uh, we could uh, we could build an urban mag. I don't think I'm gonna build any urbies anymore. I mean, there's a chance for an engine, but it'll it'll cost a lot, right? 180,000, not worth it. All right, I'm gonna sell all the salvage here. Be here. Sell salvage here. Sorry, urbies. Sorry for all of you urban mag lovers out there. I'm gonna dump my Urbies, because I don't want them anymore. This is just random money for me. Okay, so we need that stuff. We definitely need that stuff. Oh, by the way, uh, there was something in Operations that just costs money, right? Wasn't there something like that? Points, 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 points. Oh, there it is. Yeah, we need to keep some money for upgrading these mech bays, probably. We get to a 100 ton limit, we need 4 YAML points. And then we have the complete tonnage restriction from all mech bays. Interesting. 20 million sea bills, by the way. So, where are we going? What are we doing? I would say I want to really go to Liao space again so we can play some good missions there. These guys love us. Uh, we could play a recon. 
I could also go here to go for another canteen. Yeah, you know what? That's a good spot. We're gonna start our journey. I have a bunch of refits going on right now, so the Shadowhawks are coming online. We have the Thunderbolt, obviously. There's an exploration quest as well, which we could totally play. But first of all, gotta stock up on the... Oh, we have some cantina jobs going on right now. Kill Harasser, kill Manticore. Yeah, not bad, not bad. It's fine. We got, we're gonna play some missions. Okay, so the mechs are ready, mostly. Um, I know that there is a black market here. Ah, but the black market is locked now. Interesting. Some pilots are too higher. But I don't think we need any. So yeah, let's just go ahead and play some missions. Let's do that. So, 8v8 duel. That sounds totally fun. Pick a fight. Is a battlefield. Beautiful. And we have a beachhead defense. Against Liao. Uh, I mean, none of these guys particularly like us. But I think I want to just gather some items here. Let's start with the duel. And we're going to take a, a mech that is decent. Like our good old trusty Shadowhawk. I think I'll do it. Yeah, let's go with Double Hawk. I'm gonna wait for... Oh, we're over tonnage already. Uh, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. I could drop one of the fire starters to an urban mech. And then we'd be fine. Or the Javelin, actually. Yeah, I like that. So, Double Hawk. We got a fire starter. We got a Javelin. I hope. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. So they say that we are over tonnage. The problem is there is no indicator here. What my tonnage is like. Right? It's kind of awkward. Shadowhawk P is over tonnage. So this guy here. Yeah, the mech bay number two is filled with a mech that is... 55 tons. So, we gotta go to operations. And we're gonna buy this now. Make pay 2 tonnage limit 55. Not enough sea bills. Oh my god. It's gonna be good. And bad at the same time. Alright, we're gonna drop some spidey parts here. We need 500,000. I don't wanna keep the others. Actually, commando can go. Yeah, it rhymes. And what rhymes is good. Alright, so we drop the commando. We probably also dropped the fire starter. I don't think that we ever build any of these. So now we should be able to invest into this. Bagam. So mech bay number three doesn't need that. Although I could do it and I should do it. Yeah, let's get those. Let's get those going. And then we also need to upgrade this with two points so that we can run our Thunderbolt as well. Oh, that's gonna be interesting. That is going to be interesting. So we should be able to do it now, right? Yeah, great. Yeah, guys, I know, some of you don't like that. You just want to get on the battlefield, but we are playing modded here to actually put ourselves to a challenge, and I love that. More complexity is more good. For me, at the very least. Alrighty. So, we have a lot of friends. We have a lot of enemies. Our friendos are mediums and lights. So, I can only assume that my enemies are kind of the same. Yeah, we're already shooting there. All right. 8v8 duel. And usually, usually you can get some real good stuff from the duels. Because enemies, they tend to have better stuff than normal. Like high tier, higher tier guns and stuff. Also, what's wrong with my mic? Uh, give me a second. Alright. So, I should be a bit less roomy now because my microphone, uh, the stand, the stand of my microphone was kind of uh, in an awkward spot. It, you know, sunk down was rel relatively low. Alright, let's go with this. Got some damage on the Clint. I think I'm gonna go with white night vision here. Or heat vision, actually. Target Bop, bop. Let's go. What are you? A wyvern. We got some damage on you, though. Uh, yeah, let's tell the people that they should attack the wyvern first. Uh-huh, so my light mix are not in a good spot. New target loaded. Oh my, target you know one. what? I see, and that's pretty cool. Our Shadowhawk is actually using his Battle Claw. That's pretty cool. Get out of here. Get in here again. All right. So, um, actually, you need to go. Let's do it. Oh, you got a Flamer. Do I care? Not really. Pop, pop, pop. Less 
less hurtful for the eye. I'm gonna take that one. So, more damage. Ooh, I should have taken care of Mr. Hollander. Let's go. Missiles, ballistics. My missile accuracy is not great right now. Right, we need that Gauss to be go. To be go, to be gone. Got the gals, so we can turn around now. Yeah. Get your arm there. Should I? I should. I should totally try. And we got the auto cannon twos. All right. Next up is the javelin. Is not really a threat, honestly, because he has minimum range. His LRMs are not firing at all, as you can see. Let me go for the Vulcan. <laughs> so that might have been our friend with the melee. It's kind of cool to see that they are trying to get into that optimal range for their melee attacks. Good. Or maybe it was just random because we were all in a big brawl. Nonetheless, I like to see it. Okay. So, duel done. I don't know if we can uh, play another one right after that. Uh, I think it was a battlefield, right? We had a battlefield as well. But I think for a battlefield we also need some tonnage. So let's let's repair and get that Barrow and Endo upgrade from the Hollander. Sure. Why not? There's a double heat sink kit in the Clint though. Also a very viable pick. Can only take two Clint parts because only two are available, sadly. Vulcan. No. No, it's fine, I'll take the Hollander. Alrighty then. Some level ups here. Love to see it. Okay. We could get a Warhammer? Are you serious? What? That's too early for getting a Warhammer. But it's a merchant. We have no money though. Um, I'll check out the I'll check out the exploration quest in a second. First of all, I need to repair my battle max. Quick damage report on Mr. Hawk. Fine. You're absolutely fine. Melee make medium. What does it say? Medium melee cooldown modifier 25% and damage modifier also 25%. And it has the punch attack modifier of 15%. It might be a good idea to run this guy into, into the fray. Alright, let's assemble Mr. Hollander. See what we, can, what we get here, what it comes with. Interesting. You know what? I could easily click that repair all button and have a 45 ton mech on the battlefield. A uh, Pharaoh, an Endo, and a Fusion Core, and some ammo. I would drop the SRMs and just put medium lasers in the mech and be done with it. Um. Alright. So, would be something like this, I guess? That is interesting. That is super duper interesting. Uh, it would be a very nice spare mech, and it could completely drop the. I don't know. Maybe the fire starter. It's a bit slower uh, than the, the fast movers, but still runs 81 kph and it has a freaking Gauss rifle. Hmm. Interesting. And four energy hard points. I think I want to keep this guy. <laughs> Let's go. And guys, yes, I know. Uh, people say I should put all of my mechs in cold storage at the end of a month and getting them out of cold storage at the beginning of a month. But you know what? That's tedious and I don't want to do it. I'm aware that that's possible, but I know. Just know, all right? All right, let's go here. And one more thing. We're going to obviously paint all of our mechs in the right colors so that we can identify each other on the battlefield. Cool. So, Javelin, get repaired. Shadowhawk, get repaired. I kind of want to play the melee hawk myself a little bit. But hey, let's check it out. Contracts. Beachhead defense. Ooh, that's pretty cool. And... It's against Liao. I don't like it. Let's play pick a fight first. We might get some extra reputation with Marik. And then play the beachhead defense, which also nets us a good amount of salvage. Alright, let's do it like this. And then at the end, I think we'll take a look at Mr. Merchant here. So, we're a bit over tonnage. What's this guy running? Auto cannon 5 burst, LRM 5 medium laser, and then the claw. We haven't really taken a look at this yet. Should probably make a good build out of it and I believe you know you could probably go double claw on this guy easily and I should 
Let's make a melee mech. Uh, maybe we can do it already. Uh, maybe maybe today. So, this guy is gonna be a little lower than that. I need an urban mech to actually match the tonnage. Oh, we're even... Oh, we're even... We're even... Mm, even higher. So, in that case... I'm gonna take the blackjack. There we go. So, we got the jack. We got a javelin. We got an urby. And we have the trusty good old shadow hawk. Should be doable. I think we have a good chunk of bursts with our with our hawk, with our medium mech compared to the enemies. So check it out. It leads me to think that I should visit an industrial hub and make uh, the best melee mech that I can make happen right now. I think the biggest problem though, we, we would walking, generate a lot of attraction, a lot of damage, and the enemies will hit us in return, like a lot, and we would be in the middle of the fight trying to punch people, which then results into losing arms left and right, and losing, losing components in general. Stop it! No! No! Um... What? The area and the what? And the dropship is still firing at me. Holy crap. Holy momomoly. I took damage. A lot of damage. All right, let's go for the assassin first. Yeah, we don't if emergency not, evac. We're going to give those mercenaries more. hell. That's what we do. They deserve it. All right, that, that was hurtful. Uh, more enemies spawning in. There's an incoming dropship, and it's not reading as a friendly. Yeah. More? Hostile dropship above. More? Wait a second, Great I'm not prepared job, for that. We need to get that really boss out of the way. Force there. <laughs> down your mechs there are enemies behind surrender. us. Or are they frenemies? I don't know. Look at all of these guys. Oh my god. Target, Phoenix hey, Phoenix, stop it. My, my javelin is about to drop. That is a little bit too much. Uh-huh. All right. So, yeah, one of our main special pilots is about to go. All right, where's the other arm? Give me that. All right, and done. Ah! There's a Shadowhawk. Fight me, bro. Hot hawk on hawk action here. I'm in your back. I can only shoot my ballistics and my uh, missiles because I'm too damn hot. Get out of my face. No, too much! Ah, I wanted him dead, but my friends are still here. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Alright, who's, who's here still? Are you a friend? You're yellow. Uh, Blackjack is about to drop. Uh huh. Come on. I am not in a good spot right now. Why is that happening? <laughs> oh, they have a heavy rifle guy. So hammer down. That's nasty. He dead? All right. All right. All right. All right. Get your arm off. I really tried to attract some more fire, but I couldn't. Holy macaroni, and we didn't even start the fight. We didn't even start the mission. I know, emergency evac exists. Ah, uh, Kenny down. All right, cool. Mm -hmm. Exactly what we were looking for. <laughs> All right, that's a challenge mission and a half. Holy crap. Everything considered, we're looking quite okay, though. I wonder if we have enough ammo for all of this. Correct. A little toasty here. Ah! Thought I could get him with that blast. He also shut down. Okay, we call it a draw. Blub. And another one. Okay, so he's still here. Is this a friend or an enemy? Cannot tell. Better make sure. Ah. Yeah, so that was one of those mercenaries. Okay, 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 okay. So, zero targets destroyed yet. 
Let me let me do that. Okay. I think I I got hurt by doing it. Ah, come on, Irby. Why is he not going? He has no weapons anymore. I'm I'm shooting. I think we have enough ammo. I think we do. Yeah, let's get him down. So all of a sudden, this whole mission is done by two mechs only. <laughs> Let me go down here so you can actually see. There's zero out of 13 enemy forces down. I saw some tanks on the horizon. Yeah, sure. Why not? Look at this guy. It's an SRM-60 carrier. You have been betrayed. Employer units are now hostile. That is fun. Uh-huh. I hope they pay extra. That girl makes one comment about being frosty. I'll give her a watch for her. Who's with me? <laughs> alright, alright, alright. So we have to actually move to the tanks because they seem to be stuck, which we will totally abuse. 800 meters. We're almost there. We can shoot at 650. So that's our optimal range. But we need high ground first. It's gonna cost us an arm and a leg to get the blackjack up and running, but maybe we just don't. Nearly there, Commander. That's perfect. I need that ammo. Um, maybe we don't and we just get the Hollander back. That's close enough. Ready just to replace the blackjack. Here we go. Brilliant. Brilliant. Large chemical laser tier two. Not bad. Where are you? Are you inside of the buildings? Target acquired. Ah, uh, J Edgar. We're gonna take it as our secondary or. Primary is gonna be carrier. Carrier down, perfect. Where are you, buddy? Why are you not fighting? I hate J. Edgar's. Okay, so we have more hostiles, by the way. And we should go back to the middle of the map because that's where our evac is gonna happen. And I wanna be close to that, as close as possible. Are these birds or fighter jets? birds. Alright. So, Clint? Mongoose? Come at me, bros. Target acquired. Where are you? A thousand meters away, that's where you are. And I think there's a canyon of some sort. Sensor sweep detected. Sensor sweep detected. Sure. You know where I am. I know where you are. Alright, let's go acquired. and... I don't know. I kind of want to get the Clint first. I don't want to drop into the canyon necessarily. Sensor sweep detected. Ah, whatever. Gliding gracefully down to... Oh, no, he's on the... He's moving around. He's waving. He's moving around, right? Come over here, little guy. I think Irby can actually handle the mongoose, but what am I doing here, huh? Yeah. Trying to intercept. Sneaky sneak. Ah! Yeah! Tank traps! Our mech traps. There is no way I can traverse this without jump jets, right? No, oh, wait. Wiggling my way through. Hi, my target. A little bit late for the party now, but okay. Target acquired. I should have stayed here and waited. But you never know. So friendly fires are things, so we gotta be a little bit Additional careful. Contact. Just cross the perimeter, Commander. Expect company that guy. soon. We, we did some damage to the legs, so we might as well stay on the legs. My SRMs. Come on. Oh, this is not gonna be easy, guys. This is... Uh, with only two mechs... Ooh, 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 ooh. Get those legs. And then the other one. And we got it. So he hit us once. Warrior units. Ah, come on. Wouldn't get him. Oh, all right. Try again. Let's take that tank apart. Let's take that tank apart. Man, come on. Yeah, we got him. Good. And then, and then you. My SRM game is not good today, but hey, I'm gonna try my best. Stuck as well on another tank trap. Good. So we have two tanks on the horizon. Luckily, it's just J Edgar's. We can handle those. I want them to come to me, though. And again, this is the base, so our evac is gonna happen here-ish. That's where we started. That's also where we are getting picked up. Gotta keep that in mind. Okay, 
is moving more to the left now. Target acquired. I cannot see properly. The snow is actually doing a thing. Okay, standing still. What about ammo count? <laughs> He's repeating his lines, like all the time. And we got one. See how long it takes to take one of these tanks apart. Huh? It's crazy. Where are you? Where the hell are you? Okay. He's stuck. I'm gonna take that. Perfect. So, more mechs. It's another Clint and a Vulcan. Oh no. These are the last three enemies, so we're gonna already move. Auto cannons. Gotta aim, aim way higher. Down goes the heli. And here is our first customer. That was a good barrage. That was perfect. Just gotta brawl with them. Be point blank. Use all of our weapons. Oh. It's exploding. Oh. Let's get out of here. Hey, Vulcan. What's your deal? I'm gonna go all in now. Just... Just reckless attack, recklessly attacking this guy. Okay. Alright, the ballistics, the missiles, the kill? Ow. Funny thing is, we still got most of our armor, and that looked very much like a death from above attack, didn't it? Alright. That was fun. Stay frosty, Commander, and that's exactly what our pilot kind of complained about. So, let's see. That was a mission. Mm -mm -mm. It hurt us. Gotta keep our head on a swivel here. Because we wanna intercept enemies while we are moving to the evac zone. That's a lot of LRMs. Oh no. Oh no. Come on. I need line of sight. I know I need quick destruction. Come on, one more. Good. We got that. Woo. That's exactly what I was talking about. Holy crap. Alright. We good? I know that there's a J Edgar here somewhere. Target acquired. Oh, SRM 20 carrier. I'll actually take it. Because it gives me Target easy money. Destroyed. And that's the Edgar. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother Drop with him now. Let's get out of here. That's gonna cost us an arm and a leg. But hey, Target it's fun. Destroyed. That was unexpected. That was really unexpected. We got two bad random things. The mercenaries and then the employers betraying us. So what are we doing with this? Are they even going to pay us now? Am I going to take all of their stuff? Shadowhawk part. We've got only nine picks. I could build another one of those if I take this. It's not too bad. Let's make it all Shadowhawks then. Eagle. Oh, that's a good auto cannon. Tier 4. Wow. I should not take Shadowhawk parts when I'm offered these things. So we'll take the auto cannon. We will take the SRM. We'll take the medium lasers. And that is it, I guess. Alrighty then. So, incapacitated for a bunch of days. That's six million sea bills in repair. Hey, it's the bounty hunter. All right, cool. We unlocked it. Now, let me quickly check my, my barracks. These guys are not missing in action, right? They are just incapacitated, which is okay. We, can, we have them. We still have them. Holy macaroni. So, we are sitting at a million sea bills. Hmm. That's a way to wreck my finances. This guy is not recoverable. I'll drop it immedi immediately. Uh, and this guy here, also not worth it. And I know I'm not selling it for optimal money here, but it's fine. So, let's go ahead. Uh, yeah, there's the high reward quest still. What, what are we doing with this merchant? We're gonna accept this. And now, we can we can buy something, right? For our million C bills, we can get a lot of AMS. 
Raiders offers you to put a good word in for you to Free Worlds League, raising your reputation levels with that faction significantly. Mm. Or, for a million sea builds, we get four medium lasers tier four. It's kind of worth it, actually. But I need to keep my money together to build my max up. It's a good offer. I'll do it. I'll buy the mediums and nothing else. Okay. So, Cantina mission. Job not done yet. Yeah, guys. I think what we're gonna do now is we certainly go to an industrial hub so we can get our max up and running again. Um, we also need to spend some money and points into uh, Mech Bay. Oh, actually, no, wait. It seems like Mech Bay number one is the Mech Bay that is unlimited in tonnage. So we can take the Thunderbolt there and put two Shadowhawks in Mech Bay number two and three. But that's the thing. Uh, let's play around that. However, Hellcat, I want you. I want you bad. Still two million sea bills of repair. I'm gonna postpone that. I will... I mean, we have enough mechs, right? Let me take a look at the at the Hollander real quick and how, um, how expensive it is. Yeah, it's perfectly fine. We'll do it like this. Give me my medium laser tier 4. There we go. All of them in here. Alright. So now we need something like half a ton. Hmm... Could possibly drop arms. God, the leg armor is so low already. Is this even a Gauss rifle build? I mean, I like Gauss's. That's, uh, that's a pretty good idea. We can make it a little lighter, though. Our auto cannon options are very good. We have a decent auto cannon 10 burst fire. It'll only be 12 tons, plus 4 medium lasers, and we have a build. The AC5s are fine. The LB10 is good, actually. Got ammo for that? We do. Oh, wait, that's the clan one. Um, da, 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 da. We don't. I want to quickly check. There is no good ammo here, really. Oh, so LBX is not an option. Um, yeah, I think I have to drop the gals as much as it hurts me. Because the tonnage is an issue. Yes, I could not run all the late. Oh, wait. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where's my gals? There we go. Bring that back. Bring the two tons of ammo back. Is this it? Is this it? Is this it? In dropping arm armor. Like that, maybe? Okay. Don't really want to go on with, with less than maximum side torso and center torso armor. That would be a bad idea. I also don't want to drop my arms completely because replacing a com component is expensive. If that arm falls off, it's gonna cost us an arm and a leg. So what about 31 here? E? Still not enough on the center. Alright, we dropped that to maximum. I'll put that to maximum and drop this down to, like, uh, 10? Uh, come on. Is this what we do? 30 here. That would be the build for the moment. It's, uh, it's doable. That would keep the gals intact. Damage per second is not... I think we need more DPS right now. It is a good sniper weapon. But I don't think it's a great weapon for our current game plan. So no, I, you know what? I'm gonna drop it down to the... Where is the face here? To a good old auto cannon 10 burst fire. Kablam. Give it some ammo. Uh, click that max armor button right away. This is way better. Like, way better. Good, and we can give it the fourth medium laser now, which is also very good for DPS reasons. You know, it's it's just fine. A little bit of head armor. And we have a build going. That's it. Mm. Don't have the money. 
Still don't have the money. Oh my god. Is it really that expensive to drop ammo from a mech? No, it's not the ammo. It's not the ammo, it's the lasers. Okay. Alright. Alright. Alright, we're gonna get it done. Revert. Repair. Uh, drop this. Max armor. That's the armor distribution that's so costly. Fine. I'll start the work here. And we're gonna see where this is gonna go. Um, yeah, then we have a we have a Shadowhawk to repair, which we can't because we don't have the monies. Holy crap! That is intense. Uh, assassin? We can drop an assassin or two. We can also drop. The, ah, the Clint has double heat sink potential. All right, sell salvage. Because I need to click that that repair button on the Hawk, and I need to click the repair button on the Irby. Okay, 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 and we have still some money. Cool. So, one more thing. I kind of wanted to rebuild my Pirate Shadowhawk, but I don't think I can at this point, right? So what I want is another... Law. Medium hand DLC. I want to check. Can I put them... No. What can I put in this hand, even? So why is there a medium hand... That doesn't do anything. I want two claws. That's the thing. But yeah, it's fine. It's totally fine. Since I cannot go double claw right now, I'm not gonna bother with it. I'm not gonna fiddle around with it. Let me take a look at... Uh, missions. Difficulty 15, ground war. Yeah. And then a duel here. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> Alright, guys. Let's get another one go uh, done. The betrayal! Hit us. So, ground war. Give me that salvage. Also, give me that money. Thank you. Okay. So, this is what it looks like right now. Hey, but you're still bruised only. That's fine. I like it. We're gonna probably still put you on the battlefield. So, my friend, you're gonna get a hawk. Um... Then a raven? Raven is too too heavy, actually. What if I went Thunderbolt? Because I want to try this bad boy. Drop the hawk here and instead get a fire starter. It's five tons too heavy still. Okay, buddy. Have a day off. We'll do it like that. Thunderbolt hawk plus... Probably the raven. Yeah. That's how we do it. And I'll also take another pilot who is in a good spot. Roost, healthy. A check who I want to train, actually. I think it's gonna be... Snowshoe. Alright, take it away, Commander. What? You were still bru- Oh, it's We've you. Tried for this all our lives. All right, guys. Let's step it up. Ground war. It's gonna be a nice big duel again. Like, multiple, multiple lances are fighting each other. There is a commander somewhere. Uh, that our our goal is that is our goal to destroy. Okie dokie. And we have our brand new Thunderbolt with double heat sinks and ER large lasers and double LRM 15. It's great. Okay. Punch if we want to. Um, I don't think we have a beagle probe yet, which gives us the 360 uh, unobstructed line of sight thing. Uh, so we need to find our own locks. But here come the friends, and all of them are light mechs. Alright, it's not bad. They have so many mechs. Holy crap, is that a lot of mechs. They are still dropping. Ah, a little bit of a lag. Is this all we got? Seven friendlies. They have a total of... Seven Magic time. plus one. Hey, there you are. Plus another eight. Oh, okay, so more are dropping. This is gonna be like a big fight. What are you firing at? It's a good indicator. There's somebody. There's a cicada. I got my ER large laser. Isn't that great? Yeah, we're gonna hold him. 
Enemies also might come around the right side, so let's keep an eye. Keep an eye out for those. I'm tickling him though. It's not a lot. Assassin. assassin. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah, I'm getting peppered already. But you know what? I want that assassin down immediately. So we're gonna stay on him with all we got. And that is a kill. One down. Let's keep going. I think the Jenner is gonna be a pain in the butt, so we're gonna go for him. Also, a relatively easy target to attack. Huh? That's a lot, man. Owens. Cool. No, it's Jenna 2C. Oh my god, no. Guys, we stay in cover here. As much as possible. That Jenna 2C runs so many good weapon systems. Okay, stay on him with the large laser as well. He wants cover. The spider then. We take him out one by one. I think this is super duper important. Ah, the spider is now in cover. I need to wait for these to impact. Now I can change target again. They are actively seeking cover. That's pretty cool. That's target super smart acquired. of them. Alright, on Irby then. Heat management is so much better now because of the doubles that we have. Oh, the Jenner 2C is coming. I need to swivel. Ugh. To him. Take that planner down. Okay. Almost got him. We have a firing line here, guys, and you're running right into it. Target oh, destroyed. boy. Target acquired. Yeah, this Vulcan is nasty. He has that auto cannon too that's completely attacking us all the time. And you know what? This guy is an easier kill. We'll take him. Oh, okay. And the missiles. The Thunderbolt that we are running here is relatively straightforward. You know, we're gonna just set up somewhere and we're gonna just deal damage. We're gonna rain death upon the heads of our doomed enemies. And it's not the most dynamic gameplay, but it's a thing that works. Also, left flank is getting attacked. Uh, all of our friendly makes are still alive, though. I see some missiles flying, but I think you can hold this. It's fine. Good. So, Irby is somewhere here. There he is. New target, Urban Mac. Uh, that was not a lock. Target acquired. Let's go for the jab then. Bit by bit, we are grinding through them. Huh? Medium laser javelin. Oh, it's another Irby. Ah, they have multiples. There we go. That should be a kill. Perfect. So on the other urban mech now. Fire. Point blank LRMs. What? Where did the javelin come from? Oh, that was weird. Indicator. This is our, our main target, our commander. Target like the enemy. Blackjack. Enemy commander. Now that there's still a guy right next to me. Behind this little hill here. But I want to stay on the jack. New target, Vindicator. There we go. There's target the jack. Acquired. And that's a kill. It's not. That is. Target destroyed. This Thunderbolt, it wrecks. It's so good. In the scenario that we are in right now, we are dominating with our heavy mech against all of these lights and mediums. Okay. Maybe should go for Irby. Yeah. It's already damaged. And now I'm in the middle of... Yeah, in the middle of the... In the center of attention, you could actually say. Sorry, Raven. Yeah, I'll go for the guy here. Vindicator, the boss. And I'm gonna help my or call in for some help from my friends. How many missiles do I have left? The answer is a lot. A lot. There's still death in my in my tubes here. Got, got that guy. So, one more enemy. Actually, it's five more enemies, and then the commander. 
I think we did it quite well here, relatively speaking. Good Took fire. a bit of damage. Um, but not too much. And that's the Guardian commander down. We won! Is that it? Do we still have to fight? Yeah, okay, it seems like it. This all away. I really feel like the AI got some upgrades Guardian because that acquired. urban mech, it took a big hit and then it went to cover. Try to break line of sight. That's the thing that is unusual. That's the thing that I just noticed. Right, let's stay on the wasp though, because Kirby is getting attacked by all of the other guys already. Minimum range? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Up now. New target, Javelin. Nope. All right, we're gonna make a way around here. Target that acquired. is good. Blur. Careful. Always with the friendly fire here. By, by the way, that wasp is eating more damage than it should. It should be dead by now. But that's a light mech that we are attacking with splat weapons, so he's just outrunning my missiles. Uh, still have some mech somewhere. After the wasp and the urban mech, there is still two mechs online. Huh. Maybe one of them is down now. Yeah, a fight is still unfolding here. Can I help, guys? You good? You're blasting something. That just got exploded. Alright. So, still three mechs somewhere. Where? Ooh, why? Uh, I mean, the spider is looking that way, so we should probably follow him. Yeah, people are trying to get into the canyon. Maybe somebody is stuck here. Oh, you shot. Oh. Clear the commander's kill. It's about to explode. So, that guy down. I think Mr. Wasp shot something on the other side of the hill. And yes, it's only one more target. Okay. So, what about you, buddy? There we go. Vulcan. Sneaky Vulcan! Let's go for his leg. Mission complete, right. commander. We did it. Let's go home. Sneaky, sneaky. Ah, first team to kill the commander gets reinforcements. That is interesting. Okay, that's the that's the rules here. Now I know. Cool. So, we made it. We totally made it. We have to dig ourselves out of the hole of finances again. But hey, that's part of the plan here. That's part of the fun. I don't want the Jenner. I mean, I want it, but do I find more of these? Let's take it on Prospect. That's a nice XL... Endo and Pharaoh upgrade, if we get it. I'm gonna say meh to the Vulcan. I could take it and build it. But I don't want it. Got a Blackjack 1, got some Spider Parts, Urban Mech, LRM 15. That's another medium laser. Alright, I'll take it. A small laser, you know why not. High tier weapons are good. Cool. So there's nothing else we want. That means we're gonna pick things that might give us something. Like our friend the Vulcan then. Two parts here. And then one more pick for another, let's say, auto cannon tier. Oh wait, medium laser then. Okay. So we dealt 1,283 damage. Whereas my Shadowhawk dealt 72 and the Raven 168. One. Who was carrying the team here, huh? This beautiful man. Guys, that has been it for today. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.